Well, when I was a kid, I really wanted to be an astronaut. You know, floating around, no school or parents to tell you what to do. I don't really like danger. And my mother wasn't very supportive. You're gonna hurt yourself doing that! I thought photography would be cool. You know, because girls love to have their picture taken. But I just didn't have the right feel for it. You stupid jerk! If my nose is broken, my parents are gonna sue you! So, Gilby, what is your occupation? Occupation? Yes, what is it that you do now? I mean, what is your profession? Why do people have to be defined by their jobs? A person's job should not be a reflection of their value as a human being, right? I, I am not my job. I mean, why can't people just live anymore? You know, well, well, what's wrong with no, that? There's nothing wrong with that. I mean, do, do you feel like there's something wrong with that? I don't. You might as well have your job and salary tattooed on your forehead, because these days it's like, what's your name? Okay, what do you do? That's clever, but the issue is, do you like your job? Uh, I work at a crappy cell phone store. It sucks. But at least it's easy, not too stressful, and, and I can live my life. Is somebody making you feel pressure about your job? My girlfriend, Sharon. I see, and what does Sharon do? She teaches psychology at Columbia, and she's doing research for some book. Well, that sounds great. I'd love to read it when it's published. Do you live together? Well, that's another sore issue. She thinks I'm avoiding responsibility, but I disagree. I'm avoiding stress, which I think is a pretty noble quest. Stress is linked to cancer and high blood pressure. So you think that living with Sharon will actually make you ill? Well, I think living with any woman can be dangerous. Why do you think married men die before their wives? <laughs> No. <clears throat> Gilby, she's working on a research project and a book may come out of it, and you're working at a crappy cell phone store. But she's not a better person than you are, Gilby. Thank you. She just might have a brighter future. Look, man, why don't you just do something romantic together? Do you have any ideas? Sure, man, go see a movie. Check out a couple's movie, she'll love it. Oh. Like a romantic comedy? Like what? I don't know, something like, um, Jerry Maguire, it's Tom Cruise and What's-His-Face, you know, and he's running through the rain, and he goes in, and he does his whole spiel in front of all of her hard-up friends that are eating potato chips and wearing Spanx. Girls they love that stuff. Is that the one with that kid? Ten-pound head kid? Yeah, I don't like that kid. That guy really creeps me out. <laughs> Forget movies, man. Look, what does she like to do? What does she want to do? I don't know, she likes lakes, like nature. Problem solved. That's great. What, I'm gonna take her to a lake and that's gonna solve everything? Well, yeah, it's a start, Gilby. Why am I taking your advice? When was the last time you even had a girlfriend? You wonder why she doesn't want to spend time with you. Is it my shot yet? No, uh, you just lost. What? I didn't even go. I guess if you ever Google beautiful lake near New York, just stay on the first page. <laughs> it looked different in the picture. <laughs> can't trust the internet. Danger. You know, I, I gotta tell you, Bernard, I'm, I'm glad that I, I canceled my five o'clock because this is uh, far more interesting than... Hey, it's almost 6.30. Where are you? I'm gonna head in, so I'll see you when you get here. No, I thought it might be it. Yep. It was amazing. It was really amazing. I could actually feel the positive energy being transmitted through my body. You know what, Eric just got here. I, I'm going to call you back. I'm so sorry, but those clients would keep me at the office all night if they could. The good news is they're happy. As long as you made someone happy. Oh, uh, Rachel, come on. I know, I messed up. I didn't go to your thing. First of all, it's not my thing, okay? And second, you have no problem getting out of work when it's something you want to do. Weren't you just talking about your Swami Rama spiritual stuff? Isn't that all about forgiveness? You never even called. You left me waiting by myself. I didn't text. I thought I texted you. You didn't text. Yeah, okay, that was a douchey thing of me. Mm -hmm. I I'm really sorry, but you know, if you were to look at it spiritually, maybe I was trying to teach you patience. Oh, 
Fuck you. Hey, look, come on, I'm just kidding. I'm, to oh, I'm totally really? kidding. Why can't you see this is important to me? I get that, that these things float your boat, and it's just not my thing. Forget it. You know, I, th I, I thought that there would be a part of you, just, just a, a tiny part of you that wanted to be with me. Well, there's a growing part of me that wants to be with you right now. A dick joke. Classy. I thought it was pretty funny. My phone smells. Excuse me? Are you deaf? My phone smells. I want a new one. OK. Is there something wrong with it? I just told you. Am I talking to myself? I meant besides the smell. How the hell should I know? I'm not putting that thing near my face. I'll have a technician look at it? No, I, I, I don't need someone to look at it. I need someone to smell it. I spent good money, and I, I'm not satisfied. I paid for a cell phone, not a smell phone. OK, um, do you have your receipt? I bought it here. OK, when was that? What's with the third degree? Are you, calling, are you calling me a liar? No, this is standard procedure. You harass all your customers, or are you just picking on me because I'm a woman? I treat all my customers the same. So you admit you harass all your customers. Huh, I want the manager? OK, I'll get the manager out to uh, smell your phone. He's an expert on that. Thank you. I'm actually very curious to see what happens here. You break it up. No, I said I can't hear you. But I live here. Uh, just be a few minutes. The fire's out. God, was it bad? Nah, it wouldn't worry. Very small. Only one apartment affected. What apartment are you living? Uh, 706. You smoke? Nah, that'll give you cancer. Go oh, on. One won't kill you. No, I'm, I'm OK. Thank you. You want to sit in the fire truck? My kids love it. What? Oh, my god. What happened to you? My apartment burned down. Gilby, what the hell did you do? Jesus, Sharon, can I come in? Now? No, not now, but next Wednesday, does that work? Of course now. God, you stink like a thousand ashtrays. Yeah, well, fire tends to uh, uh, have that effect. God, Sharon, you know, I, I imagine you'd be a little more sympathetic, you know, something like, oh my God, Gilby, or, are you all right? Your apartment burned down? I don't know, throw your arms around me or something. Uh, why do you keep bringing boxes? You can't stay here. What? what the hell are you talking about, Sharon? You're my girlfriend. Well, I was. What the hell does that mean? Well, we broke up. You, what? When? I was gonna tell you tomorrow. You're gonna tell me tomorrow? Are you... Did you like bang your head or something? Or are you are you are you on your is it your period? Am I oh wow. Um no, Gilby, I'm not on my period, but I am seeing someone else. Already? I mean, isn't that a little premature? I thought we were breaking up tomorrow. Well, he's on his way and so you need to leave. I I have nowhere to go. I I, I just lost my job, then my apartment burns down, and now you're gonna dump me? Right now? I mean I can I at least shower before I begin my life on the street? No, you can't take a shower here, and you're not going to be homeless. So stop piling on like that. It's bad for your confidence. I'm, com I'm confident that you're insane. OK, you know what? I have made my feelings very clear. I am not going to let you give me some guilt trip. Guilt trip? You're dumping me after I've lost everything. That's a fact trip. OK, this, not going to work. You're going to have to go. You had to pick today to become a sociopath. Great. Great, he's here. Great. You are my landlord's cousin, and you came to the wrong apartment. You want me to lie for you, you nuts? You are nuts. Get out of my apartment. Hey. Hi. Hey. You're early. I just couldn't wait any longer to see you. Mm -hmm. Hi. Um. I'm sorry. I... <clears throat> 
I uh, didn't is... realize you uh, had company. I don't actually. Hi, I'm Gilby. Calvin. Calvin. Hi, Calvin. Did... Sharon, did you not tell your friend about me? Uh, no. no. No, I don't think so. Did you tell me about No, why Gilby? would I? Well, we're. <laughs> I'm Sharon's brother. Oh, yeah. great to meet you, yeah. man. Hey. What did you tell me about brother? I, I don't know. It must have slipped my mind. <laughs> Why don't you tell him about your twin bro? Twins? <laughs> Twins. <laughs> yeah, you know, now that you mention it, you guys do look alike. You anyway. see it. I see it. You no, see it. I don't think yeah. so. I don't People think so. People say that. That's not, no one says that. Though. It's kind of a thing. It's not a thing. Do you guys, no. like, uh, read each other's minds and stuff like that? <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> 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 no. 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 No, no. But we are closer than you can imagine. Oh, I'm yeah. sure. That's, you know what? That's true. That's completely true because we share the same taste in men. So you're, is that, uh, is that right? Yay. That, that's, yeah. that's right. Day yeah. is a long, <laughs> oh. loves penis. Oh. Loves penis. Okay. This one. Hey, what's okay. with all the, the boxes going around here? Are you uh, redecorating your place? Yes, yes, exactly. You know us gays <laughs> just love to redecorate. When we're not loving penis Which you so do. much, mm -hmm. all the time, yeah, we're loving <laughs> hanging new drapes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know. That's funny. I know. This guy, this, this guy, <laughs> you, you picked a real winner. God, you guys are getting along so well. I hate to break it up, but Gilby is late for his date with a man, so uh, you should go. Oh, you know what? I, I didn't tell you I changed those plans because I was just feeling a little tired, so I just want to kick back and relax. I'm just going to stay here. Here? Yeah. Alone? I don't think so, no, not by yourself. I then it's so. cool if I tag along with you, No! Me. No. No, but so, you should stay just here. Just stay. I Whatever you want, want sis. Mm -hmm. Just stay? Yeah. Okay. You know what? I'm going to get my... Jacket. Yeah. Date. <laughs> so you can stay. Stay here. Stay here. I guess. Hey, a little advice about my sister. Oh, yeah, give it to yeah. So no matter how aggressive she gets, just play hard to get. You know, don't mm -hmm. fall for it. It's mm -hmm. all a test. Like, don't even kiss her. She'll love it. She'll oh. go nuts. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thanks. Like, thanks no for problem. Too. Yeah. Gilby. The guy out. Yeah. Think you could come help me pick out a jacket? Bro? You know it, sister. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't do anything. Nothing, okay. I want you out of here by the time I'm back. You don't mean that. Yes, I do. I want you and your stinking boxes out of my apartment because we're finished, Gilby. Got it? <gasps> Get the hell out of my bedroom. huge surprise for you. You do? Mm -hmm. I have a huge surprise. No, wait, you go first. Can I, I can, yes, I go, can go, go first. Go. Okay, okay. I think I finally found something we're both gonna love. I'm all ears. I don't think you're ready for this. I, I may need a sip of water, all right. A tantric retreat. Hmm. Right? Right? Right. Um, like the thing, uh, that's a group thing though, right? Mm, it's a sex thing. Well, um. I mean, come on, it's a lot of sex with me. Or, no, with me. <laughs> um, come on, it's gonna, it'll help our sex life. That part I'm in on. If it's the sex with you and me helping the, the our sex life thing, then yes. Really? I'm in. You're not gonna take it back? I'm not You're really it. in? I'm totally in. Babe. Put it in the books, we're going. Do you realize how happy I am? Well, good, that's why we're here. It makes me so happy, okay. cheers. Okay, cheers. Now, it's not a competition of surprises, but if it were, mine would win. Okay. Are you ready? All right, I'm ready. Yeah. I want to come on. How would you like to spend three weeks in Paris? Are you serious? I'm serious. Paris? Mm. Yes, yes, please, yes. yes. Are you kidding me? Oh, when? The lunatic when? would say no. We leave on the 15th. Okay, all right, but the retreat is on the 18th, so do you... Oh, can we, can we, I, what do I do? Do I roll do around in the grass with crazy people, or do I go to Paris? We can Urgh. push it back a little bit, right? No, no, I can't, I can't. I got work in Paris. I got to be there on the 15th. Oh, right, okay. This is a business trip. Well, no, I, Was I, that I, your surprise? Do you not remember what happened last time? I was by myself the whole time. You, you... 
I never even saw you. We were at the museum. You took all those great pictures. We had a great time. Oh, which was wonderful. It's always about work with you. I'm... Work comes before me, before us, before everything in your life. Fine. Don't go. Can we get the check, miss? Yeah, we're going to take this to go. Really? You win. Do you want to come in? Mm. <laughs> What's wrong? Mm, I don't know. Just want to take it slow. <laughs> come on, you know you want to come in. No, what about your brother? Bill? Oh, Gilby? Mm. No. He's long gone. It's just you and me. Yeah. Fish sticks? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'll call you tomorrow. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Does he not like fish? Get in the kitchen. Why the hell are you still here? Okay, you know, I gave it a lot of thought and I decided that I forgive you. Oh, you forgive me? Yes, I just wanted to let you know so that you don't torture yourself. By the way, where is the tartar sauce? I how do you not understand this? It's over. We're great together. I'm, I, okay, I, we have some problems, but so does everyone. We are not great together. So you never love me? Gilby, come on. I was in love with you, but you're so immature, and I am evolving, and you're not even trying. Okay, okay, so th th this is all because I don't have a career you approve of, okay. right? All right. Well, uh, A, I don't have that career anymore, and B, how shallow can you be? You know what, you just keep telling yourself that if that's what makes you feel I, good. I, I will, Okay, I will. great, but this whole idea that work is somehow the root of all evil is an excuse for you to not ever do anything with your life. What? what? Oh, and this guy, this, what's his face, Melvin? Calvin, Calvin. Whatever, you can tell me he's the most Mature. Yes, actually. He is in touch with his emotions and his career and his sexuality. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What do you mean a sexuality? Calvin's openly bi. You could never be that open. <laughs> Finally, something we both agree on. Great. Don't touch those. Oh, they're my sticks. This I'll touch them. What happened? I'm having some work done on my apartment. Well, what about a hotel? You don't want me here? Jeez, Mom, I never ask you for anything. It's just that I thought you'd be a lot more comfortable in a hotel. Don't you think I would have stayed in a hotel if I wanted to? God damn it. I'm happy here, all right? Do you have to smoke? I don't mind you staying here, but don't cramp my style. I'm just showing a little concern for your health. Well, something's got to kill you. you know, hopefully not cancer. They don't really know about that for sure. Actually, they do. It's scientifically proven that cigarettes are linked to cancer. Have you watched the news in the last few decades? I don't like the news. It's depressing. I still don't understand why you want to stay here anyway. Is it so crazy for me to want to stay with my own mom? I mean, let's face it, considering how much you smoke, how many years do you have left? This could be our last chance to bond. Whatever. Don't wait up for me. Didn't you just love Josh's iPod yoga? Yeah, I actually was really great. It's so cool to listen to your own mix instead of having one imposed on you, you know? It's such a metaphor for finding your own joy and listening to your own sound. I mean, everyone has their own path in life, so shouldn't you be able to listen to your own soundtrack? It's so obvious. I heard next week we're all gonna swap iPods. Wow, that's so... So beautiful. And revealing to listen to someone else's mix? Wow. Oh. Here we are. Thank you. Namaste. Namaste. I'm, I'm sorry, but I ordered um, the taco. That is the taco. No, no. Okay, okay. all right. It's just... Uh... This is the leaf of lettuce and some nuts. Exactly. Oh. She's new. How about our special, the pesto alfredo cup noodles? I'm good, thank you. Here, have some mm. linguine. Oh, is Ooh. that what that is? Mm -hmm. It's cabbage, but you'd never know. Oh, for sure I know. Oh, I laugh. Mm, make a wish. What did you wish for? Don't tell me. Okay, tell me. Well, what you guys have is so great. 
It's really nice. I mean, how do you do it? Well, we don't do anything. That's the trick. I mean, we just let it happen to us. We just ride it like a wave and try not to control our love. That's beautiful. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, that's so sweet. You were here to witness that. Congratulations. <laughs> this is good for you. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Sharon wasn't right for me. You know, it was time to move on. You always said she was the one. Well, she was one of the ones. Yeah, but now I need another one. Or no one. A new one. So you ended it with her? She was devastated, you know, just uh, kind of crying and just, just begging and just, it was a mess, but she loves me and, you know. You're a terrible liar, Gilby. It was mutual. You know, we talked. I mean, we're adults. We decided the best thing for both of us right now in our lives was to just take some time. So what actually happened? She left me for this super sensitive, ridiculous, bisexual Australian artist, rock star looking type, like a robot designed to rip your heart out. Well, every time you mentioned her, you were always complaining. So, yeah, this could be for the best. You know, that's love. What did that? That is love. When you think you can't stand someone, when all you do is complain, all you can think about is what you change, when you want to kill them, that's love. Listen, I'm no expert, but that is definitely not love. Listen, I'm going to a fun party this weekend, and I think it would be a great idea for you to join. Fun? Fun is supposed to cheer me up? Come on, man, you'll meet some other people, you get sharing off your mind, it'll be great. Hold this, will you? I can't. Oh. What brings you to ITI? Uh, I need a job. <laughs> so you've had IT experience? Oh, yes, definitely. And? And, <clears throat> I was, yes, and, um, I'm, th I'm thankful. Uh, it, it's, it's helped me immeasurably, you know? I, I can't thank it enough, IT. <laughs> oh, you're joking. Yes, I'm sorry. I'm very nervous. Oh, no, because I love to laugh. I really oh, do. great. Me too. <laughs> I guess I'll just have to wait. Uh, you went to Harvard. <clears throat> yes, I did. Yes. I did too. You did? Mm hmm God, get out of here. What are the chances? Was Dr. Reynolds still there when you were? Dr. Reynolds? Yeah, Dr. Reynolds, yes. Rennie? <laughs> you know, I had so many great teachers when I was there, but Dr. Reynolds, he was the best. He was the best. He was a she. Yes, she, he, she was. And she believed that there was a, a stronger he inside of her. And through the miracles of modern science, she was able to realize himself. And he is, I think, much happier than she was. And some say a better teacher. And, I think, uh, he, you know, they made the right decision that was best for her and him, and uh, we still talk. She died. At the cemetery, you know. I, I speak to him and her, or it's a moot point now. It's mostly me, and I believe, you know, she and they listen. Mostly, you know, pansexual poetry, you know. And well, she was cremated. Right, uh, and I feel so fortunate and honored that I was you know, selected as one of the few students to receive a small parcel of ash, which I uh, divided into little thimbles that I occasionally spread in fields and playgrounds. Well, that's and interesting. And the ashes must have blown across the Hudson because that's where I spread them myself. That was you? God, what a beautiful day. I think we're done here. Okay, 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 okay. Listen, listen, Jane. Please, call me Miss Harris. Miss mm, Harris, excuse me. Um, look, I didn't go to Harvard. You figured that out. And it sounds like this Reynolds character was pretty messed up. She was my sister. Your parents must be so proud. Now, I, if you just give me a chance. My girlfriend dumped me and then my apartment burned down. I don't have the skills you want or need. I don't even really know what you do here. But if, if you just think outside the box. I think we're done here. You haven't been honest about anything. Uh, my apartment burned down and my girlfriend dumped me. Well, it was, it was mutual. I'm sorry, Shelby. Uh, okay, um, all right. Can I just take this? Because I think it's the only one I, I have. It is the only one I have. Yes. Okay. You think anyone else in the building Goodbye, would be Goodbye, Shelby. Right, it's Gilby. Get out. Okay. 
I'm sorry for your loss. Can you smell something burning? Oh, it's my jacket. Sorry, I should have gotten it dry cleaned. When did you get this car? It's a company car, man. I got a promotion. They gave you a car? Yeah, man. Well, I got a lot of stops to make. I don't get it. You, you don't actually sell anything. You just get doctors to prescribe your drugs. I mean, how hard could that be? Uh, I think even I could sell pharmaceuticals. Well, I don't think you'd really like it. How would you know? Because when I brought it up two years ago, you said I would never be a soulless corporate drug dealer. I said that? Yeah. Sorry. Look, man, I got to be honest. I, I kind of agree with Sharon. You know, your whole, I'm not going to have a career so I can really live my life bit. It's not really working out. You like my impression of you, by the way? Yeah, it's great. I mean, you shouldn't be afraid to put yourself out there every now and then, Gilby. It's like the truth is, people believe what you project. So if you present yourself as a winner, people are going to say, now there's a winner. OK, so if I buy fake gold medals and start wearing track suits, things are going to look up? Yeah, I think, that's, I think that's a good look for you. But seriously, you fake it till you make it. You know, you really want to turn things around, you should follow my advice. Look, how much more do you have to lose? You're right. I, uh, I, I want to make a change. Good. No, I need to make a change. Yes. I kind of hit rock bottom. Apartment, job, girlfriend, gone, living with my mom. <sighs> Any lower, then I'd have to do something drastic, like throw myself in front of a Bentley or... Have you looked into that? I don't even, I don't even live in an area where Bentleys drive. I, you know, I got to start with, like, a Volvo. Volvo's much more your... <laughs> Volvo, yeah. <laughs> where are we going? Seriously, this party better be worth it. What kind of hip club is in the middle of nowhere? So about that, um... Hey! hey Cappy! Oh, oh, you got so big! Oh, you have your antioxidants. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's great. Oh, hey. who is your little friend? Uh, I'm Gilby. Nibley? No, Gilby. Well, don't just stand there. Come in, join the party. Here, I'll take thank your you. Thank you, thank you. You look so lovely. Oh, you're such a Oh, I smell something hey. burning. I hope it's not my ham. You ready for this? What the hell is this? It's my grandparents' anniversary party. This is an old farts party. Yeah, I know. I uh, couldn't imagine anything worse, which is why I didn't come alone. Appreciate you being here. Grab a glass of wine, five. Do something about that. Kevin. Hey! How are you? Gertrude, you son of a gun! You just hate these things. Excuse me? I mean, it's all so fake. Everyone pretending to be part of this big happy family, then they won't see each other again until the funeral. Let me guess. Life coach? Uh -huh. Nah, I, uh, I actually ran my own company. Really? What kind of company? Uh, computers. Hmm. Didn't peg you for the corporate type. Oh, no, no, I'm not. Yeah, no, it was, uh, it was more of a creative thing. Oh. Yeah. Design. Yeah, or... actually, yeah, exactly oh. like that. Yeah, did you know something about that? <laughs> yeah, I, more than I'd like. I hear you. That's why I sold it. It just, you know, wasn't for me. You know, I had so much success so early that I didn't really know what I actually was passionate about. Good you know? for you. Yeah. Knowing yourself is its own kind of luxury. So yeah, I'm just taking some time finding myself spiritually. Well, I can relate to that. Oh, that's so cute. Oh. Yeah. I bet she's nagged the life out of him. Wow. Yeah, yeah I, I hear he's only 36. Really? Yeah. 
So let me guess, they're uh, friends of yours, uh, drinking buddies? You did time together? No, no, I got it. Uh, swinging partners. Almost. They're my grandparents. <laughs> Hey, can I get a uh, glass of wine? Come right up. Did you meet my sister Rachel? Why didn't you tell me you had a sister? I don't know, it never came up. How, how, how have I never seen her before? Why is she never around? I don't see her around that much. I don't know, our, our circles don't really overlap. Thanks. Look, uh, dude, you gotta hook it up. What are you, nuts? You're the Grinch that sold Christmas. What? What, come on, what's the problem? I'm practically family now. That's right, Nivli. Here's the problem. You see that guy over there? Smart guy, successful, handsome, great posture. Yeah, and? It's my brother-in-law. That's okay. <laughs> How many sisters do you have? I have one sister, Gilby. He's married to her. Why does everything in my life turn out to be a disappointment? Come on, man. It's train wrecks like you that make us feel good about ourselves. I'm kidding. I'm kind of kidding. Right before I was to walk down the aisle, my little old great-grandmother pulls me aside and tells me, Rhea, you need to know, a man's nature is a burden on a woman. <laughs> now go get married. That's oh, true, though. That's good. So, Eric, how's everything going at the office? Great. That's good? Yeah. That's good. And you guys are doing similar as you had done before, except this is now your company. Yeah, digital design, branding, interactive campaigns, that kind of thing. It's going well? I'm doing great. I mean, we're expanding. I've got this... Exciting uh, little gig in Paris, and uh, I need to find someone here to look after things while I'm gone, actually. Well, That's... you were talking about your design company that you that you used to own. I mean, maybe you could help you out. I'm sorry, you said what? No, oh, right earlier. Yeah, we were talking. I was telling Rachel about uh, my uh, uh, design company. I ran a company, sold it years ago. Really? I find this fascinating. Well, I'm, I'm fascinated. What kind of work did you guys do? Uh, it, it was the same kind of thing. Design, branding, uh, interactive campaigning. Yeah. Well, uh, that's great. What, we what, yeah, we don't have to talk shop, by the way, if you don't want to, because I don't mind. I don't mind. Fantastic. You know, um, this Paris thing just popped up, and I've been worried that I wasn't going to find someone to cover for me. Is that something that you'd be interested in? Or? Um, I'm certainly not on the cutting edge like I used to be, um, but I'm always curious to see what the kids are up to. Well, look, I, I don't want to monopolize the conversation. No, no, it's fine. It's... Uh, but why don't you come by on Monday and we can we can uh, talk there? Uh, great, yeah. Let's do it, Monday. Great. 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 Oh, thank hey. you. Yeah. So I guess I might have to put my spiritual quest on hold in order to help out your husband. I'm sorry. I I shouldn't have said anything. I don't know why I did it. It's fine. I'm kidding. It's totally fine. I mean, I, I probably deserve it for earlier. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you need help here? There's a lot of dishes. No, no, I got it. I'm good. Thank you. You know, I can't believe it's taken so long, but they're finally bringing competitive dish curling into the Olympics. Just look into it. Oh, you should see me carry garbage. <laughs> oh, please. Garbage is one of my greatest weaknesses. Oh, really? Yes. You must have to go to the gym to do all this. It takes endurance. No, just yoga sometimes. You yoga? Know? Oh, cool, yeah. cool. I'm I'm totally into yoga. Really? Yeah, I love it. What kind? What kind? Oh, yeah, well, I'm, of, of course there's multiple kinds. I, uh, I love it, uh, you know, the, uh, it's weight. Weight yoga. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, uh, for weight loss? Uh, well, no, I mean, it's, it's yoga, but it's weight, it's weight lifting. It's mostly for men, so but you might not have... lifting weights makes your muscles more stiff, right? Yes, no, it, yes, exactly, you're right. You're yeah. absolutely right. <laughs> you get stiff, and then you need to do more yoga. <laughs> it's sort of a capitalist approach to the whole thing. You, okay. you just keep, keep going to class. Well, you should, you should try Rama yoga. The teachers are, they're really great. Really? Yeah, yeah. that's where you go? Yeah, the Monday night class is awesome. Monday nights? Mm -hmm. That's when I have um, my gangnam yoga class, but maybe I can move something around. There's no weights, though. <laughs> no weights? More traditional. More traditional. Yeah. Mm. If you more, can handle it. More know? like yoga, you're saying. More like uh, yoga. More like Actual real yeah. yoga. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah, maybe I'll check it out. It sounds like fun. So you now run a successful company? Huh? The hell is that? 
I projected a successful image. Thank you very much. All right, I appreciate the effort. Not necessarily experimenting on my family. Oh, but... come on, I have, a, I have a little faith. I won't ruin the company. It's only a couple weeks. Just answer phone calls, shirk responsibility. And by the way, I, I think you owe me having tricked me into going there in the first place. It's fair, it's true. Seems like you had a blast. It's just too bad you spent all the time talking to Rachel. Yeah, I was having a much better time talking to uh, Auntie What's-Her-Face and Uncle Scoliosis. Scoliosis, yeah. Nicest guy. Oh, Jesus! Mom! Oh, God! That was so dramatic. I didn't even know you could still do that, whatever that is. Oh, we're not dead yet. Yeah, too bad! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I can still hear you! Uh, excuse me? Looking for Eric Stone's office? There's nothing I can do to make this better. I got it fair and square. All right? Yeah, well, if he'd wanted to offer more, then he should have offered more. If you have a real issue with it, you... no, I didn't say you see me in court. We're, do We're done with this conversation. Yeah, bye, Mom. Um, OK, uh, basically, things are running pretty smoothly here. I just, I don't, I don't need my team tempted while I'm gone. Yeah. Don't get me wrong, they're, they're hard workers. I just wanted to stay that way. Yeah. It's pretty simple. I'm looking for a babysitter. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. I, I, I know the drill. You know, been there, paid for that. <laughs> yeah. So, um, Kevin tells Rachel that you guys are pretty close. Oh, yeah, very, very close. He had some nice things to say about you. Yeah? Hey, well, if they're nice, they're true. <laughs> so, why'd you sell your company, Gilby? The question. <laughs> uh, good, good question. Um, seriously, it, uh, it was time. Yeah. OK, good. So look, I'm always looking for good people, especially people I'm told I can trust. Oh, so absolutely. Why don't we give this a shot, see how it goes? <laughs> yeah, you got it, boss. All right, yeah. All right, let me introduce you to the team. Brad's an asshole, but the rest are pretty good. Come on. Guys, everyone, listen up. This is Gilby Smalls. He's going to be overseeing things for me while I'm gone. I thought you said that I was going to look after the group. Oh, Brad, you really need to focus on your work. And don't interrupt when I'm talking to the group. You guys won't even know I'm here. Just don't make any mistakes. Gilby used to run his own media company, so don't be afraid to ask him anything, really. Well, uh, what was the name of that company? Uh, Imagine Inc. Imagine Inc. is not a media company. Brad. Imagining Inc. Imagining. Imagining uh, Design, to be exact. Or technically, the Imagining Design Company. Yeah, the old IDC, she was something. <laughs> Great. So even though I'm not here, I'm here. <clears throat> All right? Let me show you the game room. Come on. A game? We have a game room? Is this yoga? Hi. Hi. No, I've yoga before. I was yoga yesterday. Okay. Well, um, here you go. I don't need a belt. It's okay. Go ahead. Try to use this disruption in your meditation. Watch your thoughts and see what comes up for you. Very nice. Remember to breathe. Beautiful job. Nice. Hey, 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 hey. Don't force it. It's not a competition. Yeah. Why don't you just rest in child's pose? No, thank you. I thank you. I appreciate it, but I can do this. Well, at least use the wall for support. I got it, OK? Child's pose. Oh, 
Oh, God, are you okay? Oh. I got it. I got it. Rachel. Oh, Hi. hey. I'm, I'm so glad you came. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How's your back? Oh, it's fine. Only several hairline fractures. Oh, right, right. You should probably get a body cast. Yeah, Help exactly. you out, you know, straighten you up. Sure. Yeah, exactly. Right. Minor body cast yeah, injury. Yeah, no, major body cast. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what a great class. That wasn't it amazing? It was, yeah. Gilby, this is Anne and Andy. My brother, there's oh. quite some flop in there. Don't worry, it happens. Really? That's a relief. I've never seen it, but I'm sure it's happened to someone. Are you going to the sweat lodge this weekend? I don't know. I'm thinking about it, you know. Maybe. We'll see. So, do you guys want to grab a bite to eat? I'd love to. Yeah. Oh, no, we can't. We can't. We're going to be late for Reiki class. Reiki? What is that? It sounds dangerous. Reiki? You know, like chakras? What you just epically misaligned in there? Here, let me take a peek. It's happening. I'm just going to jump right in. Raw food? Do you want to get some? Sure. Okay. Well, We're going to go, so. Pleasure was mine. He's emitting a lot of heat from down there. She better watch out. I think it's actually really good for our marriage. You know, when you're together all the time, it's so easy to get stuck in a rut, but being apart makes you appreciate what you really have. Wow, you must really like wasabi. What is it they say? Absence makes the heart grow fonder. <coughs> Are you okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just... That's so sad. What's so sad? <sighs> I don't know. I think your story, but I'm sensitive. I'm very sensitive. Oh, wow. No, I think that's... I think that's really great, you know, for a man to oh. be so in touch with his core emotion. I wish Eric was more like that. Oh. You know, I keep trying to get him to come to these classes, but he's just not interested. It would help him become more centered, and it would help us to connect on a more spiritual level. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, definitely, definitely. I always say, uh, if you're not growing together, you're growing apart. Exactly, like the sweat lodge. I really want to go, but... He will never go, you know? He's just, his work is always first. I'm just tired of it. You can still go. Right. Am I gonna go by myself? No. Well, I don't know. I was thinking about going. Really? Yeah. You would want to go? Yeah, why not? <laughs> yeah, let's go. Sweat Lodge, sounds fun. You think so? Yeah. Okay. All right, yeah, no, I would, I would, I'd really like that, Gilby. That would, oh my God, look at that. You really loved your food. I, I hate mine, so let me just give you that. Uh, oh, I don't need to. You just put it all, you just put it all on there. Since you like that wasabi, let me just get that on there. Thank you. Yeah. Hey, hey, it's me. Uh, look, Gilby, I don't really have time to talk right now. Look, I, I, I just want to say, I've just been thinking, and you were right. Okay, you know what, if this is some sort of a trick to try to get back together, I'm... No, no, it's, it's not. I should have been a better partner. You deserve that. And you were right to leave me. Oh. Well, thank you. No, thank you. I just really want you to be happy. I really want you to be happy, too. Get off the phone! Oh, I'm expecting a call! I'm... Uh, Is that your mother? Yeah, yeah. I'm taking care of her. She... She broke both her hips, stepping into traffic. 
The doctors think it's dementia. She she must be having another episode. I I have to go. Okay. Okay. Both of her. Hello. Such a weird relationship. They make phones with buttons now. Did you know? I'm aware. Wow. It's so beautiful out here, isn't it? Yeah. Hi. Hey. hey. Love the face paint. Whose idea was that? Oh, we actually both did it on our own. Isn't it amazing? We're so much on the same energy field. We even think the same. Yeah. Maybe, like, psychically, we're on the same plane. Totally. Same plane. That's great. You can carry each other's baggage. Uh, <laughs> uh. <laughs> That's a good one. I don't think I get it. Stay warm. Thanks. <clears throat> Let's gather some wood, so, yeah, right? Yeah, that yeah. seems we're, to we're, be the thing uh, to do. We'll see you inside. That was weird. Hmm. Perfect. What's your power animal, brother? It's, it's, sorry, what? A power animal? It's the animal that guides you in your dream world. Mine's a cricket. Well, that's an insect. It came to me in a vision. It's my power animal. Power insect. What's your problem, brother? Enchalatul! Is there anyone here who's never done this before? No, 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 no. I did this all the time when I was a kid. Yeah? Yeah. You did? Yeah. Mm. Helped build it. Okay. Right. I'm Broken Wing. I will be your sweat lodge guide master. We will begin by collecting stones for the fire. And inside, I will tell you that the temperatures will rise to well over 150 degrees. Inside, I wish you to sweat out the technology, sweat out the Facebook, sweat the Twitter, the Tumblr, the Huffington Post, CNN. Eliminate it from your body. If the spirit tells you to remove your clothing, then you remove it. You listen to that spirit, because if you don't do it now, you never will. Let's sweat. <laughs> I think I'm suffocating. No, I think I'm suffocating. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm suffocating. I'm suffocating. I gotta get the hell out of here. Oh, hey, 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 hey. This is sacred space. Now bow to the mother. Oh, oh. oh bowing doesn't do anything. You're not bowing. I'm bowing. I'm bowing. You're a butterfly. Now bow. I don't know what you're no, talking this, this, about. Now bow. I gotta bow. get the hell out of here. Chill out. The fat lady's blocking the door. Who are you calling fat, you little jerk? Bow. 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 Bow.
Here, let me help. Well, okay, well, be, be careful. Okay, okay. I mean, did did you feel at all transformed? Transformed? Yes, I, I have been completely transformed into a cripple. No, I'm serious. I mean, you can't be exposed to such powerful experiences without being affected a little, right? Does burn count as affected? You're, are you making fun of me? No. You're totally making I'm, fun of me. I'm sorry. I'm so, I, I mean, I guess it was very intense. You know, maybe I was affected without realizing it. Oh, come on. Your burn's not that bad. What do you know? What are you not a, a, a burn specialist? This place is ridiculous. Thanks. Okay, wait, what is this FDA approved <laughs> or is this a, a broken wing product? Okay. Stop. Ah! Oh, 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 oh no, 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 stop, please. Oh, don't oh, be such oh, a baby. Please, no, no Didn't more. Did your dad tell no you more. never to cry in front of a girl? Ah! Uh, no, actually, didn't have a father. Did he? Did he pass away before you were born? No, oh, no, no, I, I never met my father. I don't know anything about him. How could you not know anything about your father? Oh, well, my mom was still on her free love trip. Well, maybe that's it. I mean, maybe that's your revelation. Gilby, you never had a, a male figure to look up to. I mean, you probably have identity issues. I can't identify with that. I'm being serious. Did you have any male role model? I looked up to Han Solo. I meant someone you knew. No. Huh. huh. There you go. I mean, maybe you should look into it. That's all I'm saying. Somehow I don't think it's that simple. I, I don't know. I think everything happens for a reason, and maybe, maybe that's why we met, so you could have this revelation. Trust me, I've got really good instincts about this kind of thing. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Well, maybe you're wrong. Or maybe you just needed to hear this at the right time from the right person. I'm just saying, here, let me, let me, let me go wash these for you. You should probably burn them. I was worried that you said it was important. Don't overreact, I just wanted to talk. Okay, okay, sorry, yeah, hi. Hi, hey. how are you? I'm good, I'm good. Come on, can you please tell me what this is about? I mean, I thought, like, your mother died or something. How can you even say that? Well, you know, I mean, sorry, like, maybe your cat. Gilby! Okay, no one died. Just, you know, levels of concern. Hi. 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 Anyway. Yeah. You look good. Thanks, thanks. You too. Heard about your job, congratulations. Oh, thank you, yeah, well, yeah. Yes, it's going well. Seems like you really have it all together. <sighs> yeah. I wouldn't go that far. But... Um... I just feel like... I was impatient with you or selfish. That's not true. I was a real jerk. Well... No, I'm just... Uh -huh. I'm just kidding. I, 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 um... I mean, I did the right thing because we were, we just were really stagnant. You feel that way, right? Yeah, no, I know. It's really, it's fine. I mean, let's just forget about it. You know, what's the point of digging up the past? Yeah. I guess I just wanted to say I'm sorry, Gilby. I'm sorry, too. <laughs> I missed you. I'm glad we can be friends. Yeah. Yeah. Me too. You're drinking now? What? It's a nightcap. Can I talk to you for a minute? Oh, honey, I don't need a lecture right now. No, nothing like that. I, I, I just want to ask you about some stuff. What stuff? Well, about my father. Oh, not this again. How many times do I have to tell you? Do you know how many guys I slept with? I have no idea. How can that be? Well, 
It was a different time then. There were no DNA tests. Everybody deserves to know about their father. How can I know myself if, if I don't even know where I came from? You came from Brooklyn. Happy? That's not good enough. I, I don't understand. Why, why can't it be enough for you that it was and it, and it is just you and me? I never thought it mattered, but now... I think I need this. James Lance. What? Yeah. He was an old boyfriend. He was in the Marines. He traveled all over the world. Now, how's that for a role model? This is great. This is great. <laughs> How, how, how can I get in touch with him? Well, now, why would you do that? He doesn't know anything about you. This is exactly why I didn't tell you in the first place. Well, well, I'm sure he would want to know. Just let sleeping dogs lie. You asked me, and I told you. Now, just promise me you'll drop this. Okay, I promise. Oh, boy, what a, what a interesting conversation. God, thank you. Don't make such a big deal about it. Are you all right? Yeah, 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 I'm great. Good. Yeah? Oh, come on. Zucky, Zucky, stop. <laughs> Zucky. Sorry, what you said? Mark Zuckerberg. Zuck, look, Billy can come, but I don't want any drinking, I don't want any incidents, and he's not in the pool this year. And no Russians. We'll, we'll still have fun. Branson's gonna be there. He says we're gonna get galactic, whatever that means. <laughs> okay, I gotta go. One of my kids walked in. I know, I know, back in the game. Oh, right, shut up. All right. Sorry about that. Some, some of the boys doing an annual get-together. This year, we're going to Larry's Island. and Well, apparently, a billion dollars can't cure addiction. <laughs> OK? Anyway, uh, what's up? Shoot. I, uh, I was wondering if you had a second to help out with the technical problem. I always got a sec for the tech. <laughs> uh, have, you, have you tried turning off the computer, waiting 15 seconds? Oh, yeah. We, uh, we jiggled the handle, too. Still won't flush. <laughs> Maybe you should take this a little more seriously. Well, let's take a look. I'll see what I can do. Sure. <laughs> let's do it. Just gonna use the bathroom. I'll be right in.
So, uh, Brad, where are we on that uh, problem? Oh, we got it. You got it? Problem solved. Already? Ah, oh, come on. I was getting ready to roll up my sleeves, get my hands dirty. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what was it? What was it? You it was, there was a little, there was a little code smell, but we cleared it right up. Code smell? I thought that was me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. Everybody remember to, you know, empty your trash and, and save, right? Okay. All right, back to work. Yeah. Uh, actually, uh, Gilby, um, I tried to look up your company, but I couldn't find any mention of it anywhere, which is strange for any tech company. Yeah, not for the game changers. <laughs> we buried her deep. Yeah, lawsuits. Lawsuits? Yeah. Oh, well, the whole game was so different back then. It was the Wild West, but it doesn't even apply now. It's boring you. You're oh. not interested. Uh, actually, I'm very interested. Yeah. yeah? Good. Good. I like that about you. Stay curious, kid. Between you and me, I think you're bigger than this place. Oh, I don't know. That's it. Ah, damn it. Hey, Kev. Well, what's up, man? Dude, I kind of feel like you've been blowing me off. I'm not blowing you off. Are you, come on, we're talking. Wait, hold on, I got another call. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Hey, do you want to go hear a Tibetan monk speak tomorrow? Yes, I love Tibetan monks. Listen, listen, you won't believe what happened last night. What? Tell me. You'll never guess. OK, so tell me. I found out who my father is. Oh, my god. Are you kidding me? The old bat finally cracked and told me. Wow, I don't... I don't believe it. What, she just... Did she just give you his number? Oh, come on, let's not get crazy. I had to sneak into her stuff and find it. But yes, yes, I've had the number. Yes. Well, how do you feel? God, I don't know. It's like a hole I didn't even realize was there has now been filled. <laughs> Seriously. You have to go see him. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know about that. Come on. No. No, you, you have to go. Would you come with me? Uh, yeah, I'm going with you. What, you think you're gonna cut me out now? No, I'm, I'm going, I'm going. <laughs> Thank you. You're amazing. <laughs> well, I know. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Gilby. Oh. Gilby. Gilby. Gil... Great. Are you sure this is it? Positive. That's the address. Well, where did you find it? My mom's address book. Oh. Yeah, Sergeant James Lance. Oh, impressive. Mm. You're an army brat. Oh, yeah. Yes, ma'am. Or Marines, actually. Yeah. Whatever happened to leave no man behind. So how do you know he still lives here? I called. Wait, you called? <laughs> You called? Why didn't you tell me? Well, what did he say? What did he say? No, what no, happened? No, no. Tell me everything. Okay, no, okay, no. okay, nothing happened. I just called, his wife answered, and I asked for him, and she went to get him, and then I hung up. Why did you hang up? Well, I just had to verify his whereabouts. I even spoke what? with a little accent so they couldn't trace me. That doesn't even make sense. That was Mr. James Lance home. <laughs> so what's your plan? What are you going to do? I don't know. I guess I'm going to knock on the door. Maybe we should buy a gift basket or, like, a <laughs> bottle of wine. An accent? That's so ridiculous. <laughs> oh, my God, is that Oh, him? no. You think that's... Oh, my God, do you think that's him? I mean, it, looks, him. it seems like the right him. age. Let's to... follow him. Follow him? We have to follow crazy? him. See, no. that's like illegal. What? what you a... can't follow no. him. He's a Marine. We He's probably armed. Him. He's like a deadly weapon. He be your dad. We're doing it. Okay, okay, okay. Do you know what you're doing? Just no, keep I don't. A I have no idea what like I'm a, doing. Like maybe five car lengths. This is awesome. I feel like I'm doing a hit or something. Have you ever done this before? No, I've never followed someone. That's creepy. Okay. I think he's on to us. There's no who way. Knows? Who knows? Who knows? Mean, my mom said he was in the Marines, but who knows after that? Maybe well, it's a Navy SEAL, Special I mean, Forces. I don't know. Are we going to write the right thing? I'm just saying, I'm just I'm saying going. don't lose him. No, I'm not going to lose him. Where's he going? I don't know. It seems like he's going in circles. I don't know where he's going. Once in a lifetime, a chance of finding someone like you. Are you 
you serious? Mm. Are you serious with the hood? Oh, stop it! It's not cold. What are you waiting for? Just go. I am not ready. Yet. You give me ready a for? minute. What do you have to be ready for? He's right there. I need a drink first. Seriously? I need a drink first. This isn't going to get any easier. It's just going to keep getting harder. You just got to do it. You just got to do it. You just got to go. You just got to understand that. Would you? Would you? Would you give me a minute? Okay. Would you give me a minute? Will you have a drink with me? I will have a drink with you. Will you be I will have one drink with you. I will have one drink. Fine. That's it. We have to and then have a man drink. And then you're going to go. Oh, no, no, no. Get this out of here. You're freaking out. Excuse me? Two scotch on the rocks, please. Yeah, I guess I'll have the same. I mean, not um, two more. I just, not four. Just two scotches, like she said. One order of two. One each. Uh, well, a scotch on the rocks for the lady. And I'll have a scotch on the rocks myself. And that will be it for us You tonight. need to pull it together. One drink, and then you're going to go fine. One drink. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God. Excuse me. All right, let's go somewhere else. Yeah. Let's go to another yeah, bar. Yeah, let's do it. I mean, why not, I right? No, 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 no. We can't be your dad. Oh, my here. God, my dad. Your dad. Oh, my God. Oh, my, oh my God, God, I do. Go. Oh. Oh. Oh, my God, I just fell over. Oh, my God, you totally just fell over. That was so weird. You just, like, you just, like, fell. Oh, God, what wow. What happened to I you? I need to switch wow. to beer. Um, another round? No, I'm so tipsy. No, tipsy. no more, no more. You were wasted. We I just wasted. fell over. Uh, bartender, <laughs> sorry, ma'am. I mean, uh, uh, another round. Yeah, for me and all my friends. Hey, go on, go on. Let's forget I said that. That was weird. Okay, go. Make a scene. Go. Wait, a little bit. What are you afraid of? Maybe he won't like me. What? That's crazy. What's not to like? I mean, you're funny, and you're smart, and you're successful, and, and you're handsome. I mean, I don't... What? You really think all that? Yeah. I really do. Drop something off for Eric. It's fine. What, what? 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 What does he need? I mean, why didn't he just email me? I mean, I can handle it. I mean, I'm, I'm fine. Seriously? I'm on top of it. I've, I've got I'm every, I've everything set up. Forget about Eric. It was just an excuse. I needed to talk to you in person. Oh God! Thank God! I mean, I'm fine here on my own. Okay. Last night was a huge mistake. Absolutely. And I need to be absolutely clear with you that it cannot continue in any way. Absolutely not. Absolutely I mean, not. it can never happen again. Never, never. I know, I know. Right? Right. 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 We're not bad people. I'm not a bad... I know you're not a bad person, but I'm not We're a bad good person. people. That was bad. That, that was, was bad. That was bad. That was really bad. It was out of control. And we were out of control. I've never been so uh, wildly... No, it was wild. It was... It out was of never. control in my life. It's I mean, not I, us, I, That right? was not me last night. I mean, no, it was like wasn't. two it animals. Was wild it was animals. Sort of expl it exploded. exploded. It was like it was a strong. sort of terrifying pornographic oh, film yeah. or something. It was wild. <laughs>
shakes their head in disbelief and says, I'm too caught up. I'll come back home without my things, cause the clothes I wore out there I will not wear around you. And they'll be quick to point out our shortcomings and how the experts all have had their doubts. on things we don't know about Ain't it like most people I'm no different We love to talk on things we don't know about I think you should go talk to your dad Oh I feel ridiculous What am I gonna say? I don't know Don't think about it Just just let it happen. I don't know. Knowing me, I'll just you know, mess it all up. And I'll, I'll blurt it out at the wrong time. Well, you'll know when the time is right. I love you. Don't say that. I do. No, Why don't, not? No, don't say that. I, I know this can work. No, I, I love my life, my, my home. Yeah, you didn't say your husband. We talked about this. I, I told you that the only way I could continue was if we were done by the time Eric got home. You told me you understood. Right? I mean, you, you said it yourself that we could treat this like a vacation from our boring lives. I know what I said, but I don't know how to stop now. I didn't think I was going to feel this way. Well, me neither. I mean, I... I'm married. You're still coming tomorrow, right? What's tomorrow? The surprise birthday dinner that I'm throwing for Kevin. Did you forget? I, are you crazy? I can't come to your house. I can't see Eric. I, are I you? Can't. No, no. You have to come. It's it's done. You're coming, right? I don't. I don't know any of Kevin's other friends. You're the only one I invited. Um, okay. 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 I'll come if you promise me one thing. Okay. What? I know we can work. Please, just think about it. Just think about it. Okay, please. Just, it's just so good to hear home. Oh, she's, she's still doing well. Yes, yeah, she's doing well. I, <laughs> hey, listen, look, thanks for meeting with me. I, uh, the reason I called was, um, uh, <sighs> all right, here it goes. I'm your son. What? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm your son. And you're sure? Yeah, yeah, I'm sh she just told me. Oh, oh, jeez. That's heavy stuff. I know. That's I... heavy stuff. I'm not a kid. That's heavy stuff. I know, I know, I know. I, I mean, I, I, I don't know what to do. You know, I don't, I don't know what we should do now. Give your man a hug. Come here. Whoa. Come here. Come here. My boy, then you be my boy from this moment on. Give us another round here, me and my son, right here. Go ahead. Thank you. Thank you. I was. God, you're so cool. Hey, thank you. Dad. Dad. Oh, Jesus. Dad. Nobody ever called me that in my life. I never was a dad. You know what's really unbelievable? <laughs> For a kid in his 40s, you're so beautiful. Come on, you gotta be glad you got her jeans. I'm, uh, not, not 40s, I'm, I'm 31. <laughs> no, man, Beck, it, it can't be, buddy, it can't be. I haven't been with man over 40 years. 
Well, you must be remembering wrong. Because... No. No. Kid, they, they sent me to war. I got shipped out to Vietnam in 1969. I mean, May and I were, were, were well over by then. Well over. The timing is wrong. I'm not even mad. Give him the drink in him. Give him the drink in him. Don't no worry about it. Come on. Jesus, come on. Have your drink. Come on. Have your drink. Thank you. I'm sorry. So long. Atsumarono me. All right. I can't believe you. Do you know how much money this is going to cost me in therapy? You said it would help you if you had a father, so I gave you a father. Can't you hear how crazy that is? It's, it's like the Dumbo story. What? What the hell is the Dumbo story? The crows gave him a magic feather so he could fly, but he didn't really need it. He could fly by himself, but he didn't have the confidence. What are you talking about? Well, didn't I take you to see Dumbo when you were little? No. Oh. What about the Wizard of Oz? No! Oh, would you like to see them now? No, I don't want to watch them now! How could you be so dishonest? I never claimed that I was above lying. Hey, guys, morning. 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 Hey, Brad, where's that memo I asked for? No memo. Last day humor. Come on. Okay, hang on a second. I just, I just, let me just finish this. Okay, it's no, fine. No, no, I, I've been fine. on a plane. Just don't be no, 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 no. Please, please. I know, I know. Please, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to be late. Hang on, just two seconds. I'm going to go run the errands, and I will go pick hang everything on. up. Just, there's the man. He'll be, yeah. Hang on, let me just send this. Uh, okay, I can help literally. Hang on a second. Carry on, too. Can you please hold him? I want to talk to him. I, I've been trying to reach him all day. Okay, I'm going to go. I might be able to help you in, like, 15 minutes. Okay, I just have to well, take this just call. call me, then. It's fine. I'll see both of you um, later. Okay, Bye. Au revoir. You want me to help with that? Oh my God, could you help over the grocery? Yeah, yeah, it yeah, literally yeah. take 10 minutes and then come back and I'll, I'll have a full right recap. Back. Sure, yes, okay. see you. Okay, good to see you. He'll be. Okay, put him on. What are you doing? I told Eric I'd help you. Hi. <clears throat> Do this right now. When? I don't know. Toby. Hey, man. How are you? Hey. Wow, look at you. You're looking bloody fantastic. <laughs> How are you? This is Rachel. Hey. Oh, hi. Hey, uh, what was your name? Sorry, Calvin. 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 Did it's I not see this? So how do you guys know each other? I'm dating Gilby's sister, Sharon. Oh, I didn't I didn't know you had a sister. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. You know what? You guys should come to my dinner party tonight. No. 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 I'm sure they can't. I'm sure you have plans. Oh, we're totally free. You're we really are. Uh, yes. That's great. That is great. It's actually Gilby's best friend's my brother's birthday. Does okay. Kevin know your sister? My what? Uh, I mean Sharon. Yes. Yeah. Kevin knows Sharon. Well, this That's is great. Right. Okay. So I'm thinking. Um, Enish, is that, no, does that, that work? works. Oh, perfect. Or, or don't, you know, eight at, I'm sorry, she's usually not such a fascist. I'm sorry. <laughs> come by at eight, at 8.30, the trains leave. You know, and, 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 come on. It's going to be fine. It I sounds like know. lots of fun, actually. I don't know. Hey, buddy, it's great bumping into you guys. Yeah. Really, you're looking great. The thing, I was just about to walk right past you. Imagine that. Okay, no, so imagine if I've that had happened. Yes, 8 p.m. <laughs> You're all set, yes. Yeah. So great. I'll see you tonight. Wonderful. Unless you can't make it. In which case, don't worry about it. It's not a big deal if you have to cancel. Don't essentially hey, forget Kobe, it. I think he's got it. I... He's got it. Okay. Okay. So I'll see you tonight. Okay, right? great. Thank you, by the way. No, no worries. Nice to meet you. If, if something else comes up, I'll see you tonight. I'm going to see you tonight as well. Wait, okay? Wait, tonight. Rachel. Hey, Eric. Hey, Brad. Uh, can I talk to you for a minute? Not a good time. I'm already late. It's really important. Brad, please, can this wait? 
Actually, Eric, we should talk about it right now. I'm sure he'll be here any minute. I don't, I don't know what's keeping him. So how about in the meantime we listen to some music or something? Yeah. Music. Yeah. Good That's one. a great idea. You want to show me? I'm just kidding. Sorry, music. Sharon, I was the other day. So. I'm gonna. No, I'm gonna. Yeah. <clears throat> hey, have, have, have you thought about? No. No, 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 you haven't, no, no, or no, like, no, like, no, like, what is going on here? I'm trying to crack a vault or something. Mm -hmm. What is going on here? Hey, can I talk to you for a second? Uh, uh, yeah, hey. You're avoiding me, man. I can tell. What's going on? What are you talking about? I'm here at your, your birthday party. You came screaming, you came here. You don't want to call me. You don't want to try to call me. Hey, guys. Hey. Can I talk to you for just a second? I was actually really? talking to you. Maybe just right? a second, then. Who's helping so, Melvin? Oh, you right. should come with me. Here okay. you go. Thank okay. you. Uh, Sharon. Come on. Can I help with this? Turn the music on. Music on. I don't know how to work the guy. Rachel, do you know how Kevin, to... Kevin, not now. Whatever happened to happy birthday and a smile? These all-in-one remotes never work. I have no idea what is going on. You think anyone else is going to join us here? God, I hope not. Isn't this place really great? Hey, who is she? Are you with her? What? What, <laughs> Rachel? Are you kidding? She's my boss's wife, for God's sakes. What does that have to do with anything? Huh? Oh, hey, hey, you gotta work. Eric's hey. here. Hey. Oh, 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 my God. Oh, Bastard sleeping with my wife. What? Damn, oh, damn, 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 Rachel, don't deny it. What are you talking about? How could you? You all need to just calm down. This is one big misunderstanding. Look, it's impossible for Gilby to sleep with your wife. Yes. Why is that? Because Gilby is gay. What? What? Yeah. yeah. You're gay? Yeah. OK. Oh. Jesus. Guys, I am gay. I'm gay. So we are gay. No, I'm not gay. All right, I admit it. Rachel and I were together. What? what? I, you were cheating on me, you asshole? You mean what? You're sleeping with your brother? Oh, oh my God. God. Oh, you. Oh. What a degenerate are you? No, no. That's it. They're not. That's bad. No. No. She is the hot, my sister. About. He never had a company. Brad ran a background search on this creep. He's a complete scam artist. It sounds worse than it is. So you lied to me about everything? No, I was never more honest in my life than when I was lying about all that oh, stuff. Gilby, you know what? I need you to get out. I wasn't lying when I said I loved you. Oh! Oh! oh. Will everybody stop hitting me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. oh, my... Everyone get the hell out of my house. Now! Oh. All right, I have just one question. If you press the auxiliary two button, is that the video monitor? Get out! Oh. Oh. Um, I mean, you must just be so proud of yourself. Oh, give it a rest, Sharon. I started seeing her after you broke up with me. Did you? Really? Yeah. Do you really love her? I'm standing right here, guys. Oh, really? You mind? Is that oh, where hey. you are? Are you yeah, right hey, there? In fairness to... Long hair McCat here. He's the only one who hasn't been full of shit all night. My birthday night. Thanks. Happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday. Uh, that's so nice. Guys. I honestly yeah. wish you'd never been born. I've never had a worse time. Hey, do you? What? Do you love her? Why? Why do, why do you care? What does it matter? She obviously hates me. Sharon, can we just go? Just you go, just just go home, okay? I just need to talk to him for a minute. You know what? Fine. Do you love her? What about Calvin? You love him? No. Well, what do you expect? You screwed me over, Sharon. I'm sorry. Oh, come on. Come on. 
Come on. Go in. Just Come on. Come on. Stop. Come on. What was, the, what was the word you used, seeking? Yeah, that's why you needed the gurus and the yogis. That's why we spent all that money, because they needed to help you on your path to, to spiritual enlightenment, and yet you're completely morally bankrupt. I'm not I haven't happy. finished yet. What happened to your quest for the truth? I'm not happy. Eric, I'm not happy, and I haven't been for a very long time. How can you not be happy? I, I've, I've given you everything, and you're still not satisfied. That's exactly it. Right there, what you just said. It was never about any of this, okay? Listen, I am not trying to make any excuses because I know I screwed up. And I never intentionally meant to hurt you. Well, you got what you needed. Permanent change. Everything's great. I mean, I finally understand what it means to be in a, in a real relationship now. And we moved in together, and that's great. Uh, I got a great job. Our future looks great. Hey, Gil, look what just came in. What? Oh, wow. Oh, <laughs> this is so cool. Look at you. <laughs> hey, hey, I'm so proud of you. Thank you. Listen, can we? Promise to just never lie to each other again. Absolutely. Yeah. I promise. But if you ever have a meaningless affair, I don't want to hear about it. What? 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 That would be lying. Well, not if I don't ask. Why did you sleep with Calvin? Gilby, come on! I already told you I didn't do that. You don't need to ask again. Yeah. You want to know why I never made a move on you? Why? I told him you'd like him a lot more if he didn't kiss you. Uh huh. Yeah, I was like, hey, I know my sister, and if you move too fast, she will dump you. <laughs> <laughs> you are so smart. Yeah. Sharon was wild in bed. She was crazed all the time, really. She, she wore me out. Oh, God, so you loved it. It was fun. All right, I shouldn't have asked. Hey. You want some? Um... Jealous, are you? No, I'm... I'm just surprised she gave you such a thrill ride. That's right. Regular thrill seeker. You're forgiven. Hey, Andy. Where's Anne? Please don't remind me. What do you mean? Oh, I guess you didn't hear. We broke up. Oh, my God, you're kidding me. Yeah, I always kid about matters of the heart. Anne wasn't right for me. Plus, she slept with my sister's boyfriend, so there's that. Oh my God, I'm sorry. I, I, I thought you guys were so perfect together. Really? Did you? <laughs> Namaste, asshole. I just feel so guilty all the time. Why can't I stop thinking about Rachel? I mean, I, I, I have everything I want. Everything really is great. And that situation was totally wrong. I, I mean, I don't even want her or anything like that anymore. It sounds to me like you need closure. Have you even spoken to her since that night? No. Maybe that's why you're still struggling with this. Why don't you just call her? I can't do that. Why? Sharon and I are in a really good place. We're being totally honest with each other. I'm not suggesting anything salacious here. A simple conversation is not a crime.
Gilby. Hey, how are you? I'm good. I'm good. I haven't seen you around yoga lately. Oh yeah, I don't, I don't do that anymore. It's just a, a phase, I guess. Oh really? Yeah. Yeah, you know, all that seeking stuff. Maybe I just had too much time on my hands. Actually, maybe all I needed was a job. So what are you doing here? Uh, I'm not really sure, to be honest. Um, everything ended so weird. Uh, Rachel, I'm really sorry. Oh, come on. Shit happens, right? Just forget it. You don't hate me? No, I don't hate anybody. It's a complete waste of energy. I know I was a mess then, but that time really changed me. I mean, you, you really changed me. You were a good friend. Look, you never really knew me, and I had no idea who you were. Hey, for what it's worth, I thought it was special. I think you're romanticizing something that was never really there. Wow. Wow. I never thought about it that way, but I, I guess you're right. Yeah. Go home, Gilby. We can still be friends. We never really were. I just don't know exactly. I wish I had the words. I don't know what to say. Say goodbye. Just take it off. I'm just gonna rip it. Oh, you told me. I'm just kidding. <laughs>